Mr. Mayor, earlier we were talking about PIP, personal injury protection. Yes. Um, I had never heard of that term before. Do are, are a lot of your clients that are from Kansas, do they are they aware that they even have an automatic forty five hundred dollar medical expense no fault expense built in to their policies? I, I think I think the answer to that is probably no. I think they they f probably first learn about it if if a injury is serious enough that causes them to go to the hospital, the, the emergency room, and the emergency room personnel understand that if this is a Kansas accident, that they they question and they look for the auto insurance of the driver, and so that, that's when that's when people may become aware that they have that coverage. So this is actually very, this, this could be huge for, because if, if I kind of hurt just a little bit, if I'm in Kansas and I get in an accident and I kind of hurt a little bit and I don't have health insurance, I don't want to, you know, I, that's another bill I don't want to deal with because I just, my car insurance is just the basic and I don't have any health insurance. And so I would tend to not go because I'm not aware of that, of the fact that there's what's called PIP insurance built into my auto insurance policy, which you were just explaining a few minutes ago, the difference between Missouri medical protection and Kansas PIP. Could you explain that one more time? I think this is... <clears throat> well, in Missouri, uh, insurers sell what's called MedPay, medical payment coverage. Mm -hmm. And I've seen it, and and it's um, it, it's an option. It's not required by statute. State the law doesn't require it. It, it comes in increments as low as five hundred dollars, and all the way up to I don't know, you know twenty thousand, twenty five. And it's very inexpensive. I think five thousand dollar coverage is probably about fifty dollars a year, maybe more. I don't know, but not it's it's it is relatively inexpensive. But you have to ask for it. Mm -hmm. It doesn't come automatically. Um, in Kansas, it's by statute, the lowest number is 4,500, and it's called PIP. It's PIP, Personal Injury Protection. And you can also buy up. I mean, I, I, the, the highest I've seen in Kansas is $27,500. Um, so that's just a question of how much you, coverage you want. But if, if you don't ask, you're going to have the 4500 because that's required by statute. Uh, there are other insurance differences between Missouri and Kansas, but that's a significant one. Also, you know, Missouri, uh, every, both Missouri and Kansas insurance policies pro, must provide by statute uninsured coverage. But in Kansas, the, the, they're required also to provide what's called underinsured coverage, while, whereas in Missouri, that's an option you have to ask for it. You don't get it if you don't ask for it. And uh, if you suffer a serious injury in an accident because of someone else's negligence and that person only had $25,000 coverage, you could well be in an underinsured situation. Say your injuries are $50,000 and the other, the other driver only had twenty five, dollars and if you don't have underinsured coverage, then there's no protection for you beyond the limits of that policy, effectively. I mean, you can go after the person, but I mean, uh, if a person only has a $25,000 policy, they probably don't have a lot to protect, and going after them is, is kind of like going after drilling a dry hole. I mean, there's not much chance of recovering anything. So, but back to the, to the PIP, yeah. People in Kansas, I don't know if they know they have it. I think they find out, most of them find out when they when, when they go to a provider and the provider asks them for their for their auto insurance information. So, you know, they, why do they want to know that? The other thing is that what people have to understand is that by statute, uh, the, the auto insurer in Kansas gets to subrogate, which means they get to recover what they've paid when, if there's a settlement. And uh, they can't do that in Missouri because it's, it, it, you know, Missouri, public policy is that they, they don't allow that an assignment of, of injury benefits like that. Uh, but Kansas, by statute, the, the auto insurer gets to recover what they paid. It's subject to the, the cost of recovery. So if there's an attorney involved, then the, the attorney part of the attorney fee comes out of what would have otherwise been paid 
to the insurance company. So it really is a discount for the client uh, to make sure they get appropriate care and, and then they don't have to repay all of that money. Uh, Interesting. Lots of, lots of fascinating information. And again, this would be, because of the complexity, this would be another prime reason that, to call and ask, especially if you've been involved in an accident and you want some, um, I don't want to say free legal advice, but if you have some questions and you want some answers, there's certainly, you're not going to charge somebody to, to answer the phone and at least guide them in the proper direction so that they're not in the dark. No, if we can't, we're happy to provide answers to people. And, and if they don't think that we add value, that they don't want to hire us, then that's, that's okay. You know, we, we ha we're doing a good job. We obviously, you know, we've got uh, a base of clients. Yes. And they, and they come back, you know, and they refer their friends and family to us. Yes. So, you know, if, if, we, if somebody calls and, 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 you know, grills us with a bunch of questions and they're still not satisfied and don't think we can add value to their claim, that's okay. Yeah. That's okay. I, I witnessed it firsthand Friday Friday evening with the gentleman that was quite happy leaving here. I, I don't know the details and I don't want to know the details. It was just it was awesome to be able to sit back and, and see the relief that he was experiencing right there. Yeah. I mean he, he you could just you could see the gratitude just and that and as you were saying, this is this is your why. This is why you want to be able yeah. to help people. Yeah. Yeah. I, well, I just I won't forget that Friday night just at the end of the he, he was just so excited elated again thank you so very very much right. and you have a wonderful afternoon thank you for sharing all this information uh, for anybody that wants any of the information that we've discussed or if they have any questions I'll put the link to below that you can click on to go to the website and the phone number information of where you can get a hold of Mr. Mayor or Mr. Rosenberg and ask any questions that you might have. We invite that. Excellent. Thank you so much. Thanks, Wes. Yes, sir.